Hey guys, this is Brad with Diverse Dimensions. Today we're going to talk about how to download and install macro toolbars in Polyworks. Uh, this is new for Polyworks 2020 and I'm going to show you how to do that. If you haven't already created an account in the Polyworks Technical Support Zone, refer to my previous video on how to create an account for Polyworks Technical Support Zone since we will be downloading straight from there as a resource. So once you log in to Polyworks Technical Support Zone, go to the macro zone along the top of the screen. And today we're going to, um, we're going to download this laser tracker field checks. So something to keep in mind is that obviously they're organized based on if you're using your workspace manager or your inspector or even just trying to get some macro basics. So within these groups, obviously it matches the group title name, but also in version, it'll tell you what version it's capable of going to. So if you're still running 2019, it will work if you have IR10 currently installed for this one here. And for this one, same thing, 2019 IR7. So that is nice in case you were to download it and you're running 2015, 2016. Unfortunately, it's not going to be capable to run within that rev. So if we click that, it gives you a nice little overview, uh, short description, screenshot, and two files here on the right. The first one is this .pwtlb, so that stands for Polyworks Toolbar. And the one below it is a PDF that you can download and view, and it shows you exactly what it does. So Polyworks has done a really nice job in creating this user guide to coincide with this toolbar. So I know that Polyworks is going to be releasing this in some upcoming IRs. So this might already has happened since you are seeing this video. But as of now, this is a great add-on for this current IR that we are running. So if we click on this link here, it's gonna bring us to a download and it's gonna start downloading it. If we open up our Polyworks, create a new project here. And we open up our inspector. Once you have your inspector open, um, you'll be able to import this and install this toolbar. There's two ways about going about this. The first way is navigating over to tools, visual layout, customize. When you give that a click, this will appear, this little dialog box. The second way of getting there is right clicking in any of this white area above and below your workspace and then going to customize. There's a couple of things to keep in mind in here. So in toolbars you'll see this STD, that stands for standard so that comes with your Polyworks install. And then what you'll notice down here is this USR or user defined toolbars or user defined settings. And you'll see this across Polyworks. Since I already have it installed, I'm just going to delete it and re-import it. So very simple, just press import, navigate to where it is and press open. Once that's open, you can press close and it'll appear in the upper left here and it'll say install and then whatever the toolbar name is. So if you give that a click, it just simply installs it into your user configuration and then now you're able to move it, place it wherever you find it useful. Thanks again for watching today and uh, if you have anything that uh, you would like to personally cover more in depth, feel free to reach out to us at training at diversedimensions.com and we'll go from there. Thanks, guys.